The quest for perpetual energy has long captivated the human imagination. One intriguing avenue in this pursuit is the self-powered AC generator, a device that harnesses the mysterious phenomenon known as counter-electromotive force, CEMF, or back electromotive force, back EMF. This essay delves into the fundamental principles, practical applications, and the reality of free energy generators powered by SUMF. Basis of the principle. SUMF, or back EMF, is a remarkable phenomenon in the world of electromagnetism. It refers to the voltage or electromotive force generate electromotive force generated in response to the current that induces it. SUMF is particularly prominent in alternating current, AC, circuits, as it results from magnetic induction, a concept grounded in Faraday's law of induction and Lenz's law. Within the coil of an inductor, for instance, the induced magnetic field gives rise to a voltage drop. What's intriguing is that the polarity of this voltage is always the reverse of the input voltage. Furthermore, back EMF is a term most commonly used in electric motors, where the relative motion between the motor's armature and the magnetic field induces a voltage. This effect is not due to the motor's inductance but is an entirely distinct phenomenon. The self-powered generator capitalizes on SUMF to convert it into two valuable forms of energy. Dielectric energy, psi, expressed in electric current, I equals d psi slash dt. Magnetic field or voltage, quantified by the rate of change of magnetic flux, phi, over time, represented as V equals d phi slash dt. When a magnet rotates on the rotor axis, the induction coil on the stator generates a reverse voltage, creating a force that opposes the magnet's rotation. This force, fundamentally, is generated by the back EMF of the AC generator. If the coil is wound as Nikola Tesla did, in a bifiller coil configuration, the back EMF transforms into dielectric energy in the form of electric current. In this way, there is no force to impede the magnet's role in the voltage generation process. A self-powered generator utilizing counter-electromotive force becomes a free energy generator when back EMF is converted into dielectric energy, subsequently charging a capacitor. This energy can then be extracted and transferred to an induction motor, which provides the necessary energy to overcome friction within the AC generator. The supply process typically involves a flywheel and belt, serving as the connection between the induction motor and the AC generator head. A practical example. One practical example of this concept is the Dennis Sabaran generator. Sabaran has ingeniously constructed a self-powered generator capable of running indefinitely while charging a cell phone overnight. The construction of this device is deceptively simple, with a small motor at its core. A yellow plastic float from a fishing net, adorned with four magnets, serves as a lightweight rotor. The rotor, if needed, can be crafted from alternative lightweight materials if acquiring a professional fishing net float proves challenging. The magnets utilized are N52 grade neodymium magnets with a diameter of 20 mm and a thickness of 5 mm. The motor is powered by a 3.7 volts lithium ion battery, and eight output coils are strategically positioned around the rotor. These coils are connected in pairs, with four pairs powering the system. Reality proven. Dennis Sabaran's generator is just one example among many generators based on the principle of utilizing back EMF for free energy generation. These devices vary in complexity and efficiency, depending on the level of electronic knowledge applied. Sabaran's version, in particular, is a simplified model not designed for high-power AC generation. It primarily serves as an educational tool to illustrate the potential of free energy. Harnessing the power of back EMF the exploitation of back EMF extends beyond AC generators and has historical ties to the pioneering work of Nikola Tesla, who explored its applications in the realm of radioactive energy. When back EMF is properly harnessed, it can generate electrical cooling, where electric current powers devices without generating heat. Instead, the loads absorb ambient temperature. This unique form of electrical energy can be considered a manifestation of negative entropy. In conclusion, we have explored the fascinating world of self-powered AC generators, driven by the enigmatic force of counter-electromotive force. While still a subject of ongoing research and debate, these generators hold promise as potential sources of free energy. As technology continues to advance, it is essential to remain open to innovative solutions that could reshape our energy landscape. Nikola Tesla's legacy and the work of modern experts, as exemplified by the Ultimate Energizer Guide, offer intriguing possibilities for the future of sustainable energy generation. In Planet, we have a gift for you that is, tricks to reduce your electricity bill by at least 75%. And the way to complete energy independence, get rid of the monopoly of big energy, you will never have to pay for electricity. electricity. Method, amplify electricity to make output power greater than input power. 
See link in description. Thanks for watching.